guys, welcome back to Ash Timber Fest. Do you want to do it? Yeah, I'll do it. Okay, go. Hey everyone, welcome back to Ash Timber Fest 2020. <laughs> I forgot to film the intro on my other camera, so. Today we have Dexter with us. That's me. Hot Dexter. <laughs> and I am Dexter's victim. I was inspired by a milk, I think it's 1422 face chart for this. I will link, but um, all you really need for Dexter is, you know, the bloody plastic wrap, and that's it. Yeah, and me. And Dexter, of course. <laughs> we are very excited to be bringing you a couple's look this year. We haven't done it in a long time. And, um... What was the last couple's look we did? I think that, like, little... Or was it... Did we do... When I was the grandmother? <laughs> yeah, no, or when, um... Harley Quinn and the Joker. Oh, no. <laughs> that one. <laughs> That we did for a YouTube video because everybody, the year everybody was Harley Quinn. Jace is done laughing about being the Joker. And I was saying, don't forget to enter the giveaways on Instagram. Check out Ashtoberfest merch. And stay tuned to the very end to see another couple's costume that we collabed with. Uh, Joanna and Chris. And their costume turned out really cool. So stay tuned. Anything else? Want to say anything else? Have a safe Halloween. So for this look, I had already done my makeup for the day and I'm just gonna wipe off half of my face and my lipstick. And I am doing a brow cover yet again. I'll link another tutorial and I'm gonna speed through this because I am not the one to be teaching about brow covers. This look is a recreation of a face chart from Instagram. I will link them down below so you can check them out. Basically, I'm just gonna use the reference photo and map out the features on my face using a pencil. Just using a stone pencil from MAC for this, but you can use any light brown shade. It's really important when you're doing a skull or skeleton kind of look that you match the features of your own face, so it is easy to wipe away and redraw them when you use a light brown pencil. Now I'm gonna fill in all the shadowy spaces with black cream paint. And then before I shade too far down on this mouthpiece, I'm gonna draw in the teeth, which I draw on the teeth right here, and then I end up wiping them off and kind of finishing them a different way. I wasn't liking how they were turning out. So after spending about 30 minutes on the teeth, this is what they look like. Next, I'm taking some white cream paint and adding some highlights before going around and shading with some gray eyeshadow. Also just setting some of the cream paint with a translucent powder so that I can go and shade over it with eyeshadow, which makes it a little bit easier when you're working with a small space. Taking my NYX Epic Ink Liner, I'm drawing some cracks around the face. And this is where tragedy struck and my camera just did not save 30 minutes of footage. The clip is gone. But basically all I did was, you know, go back and forth highlighting and adding shadows and then adding some blood spatter for Dexter's signature look and that's it. All right, so that is the finished look. Jace is here, he wasn't in the tutorial, but he's Dexter, obviously. If you'd like a tutorial on this look, <laughs> let me know. <laughs> um, we just got this shirt at Target and the apron, so that's all you need, plastic wrap. This is a really affordable look. Obviously you can do any makeup that you want because you're dead. Um, but yes, thank you for watching Ashtoberfest. Hope you enjoyed. Stay tuned to see Joanna and Chris create their couple's look. That's all, folks. <laughs>amazing all right is your hair real or you have extensions oh extensions oh, for sure okay I same <laughs> right off so much of my hair from bleaching it myself like this is real whatever this little piece is but like i have the worst roots right now so yeah me to. too well i mean kind <laughs> of what about you chris you have extensions in no oh, of course <laughs> not guys always have yeah. the best hair we cut it like probably every other month that grows like so fast and it's just like 
Can you not? <laughs> <laughs> I know, it must be nice. His hair grows so fast, too. Yeah. Like, he just got it cut, and it's already getting long. I'm like, it must be nice to have that kind right? of hair growth. <laughs> this whole thing with having other creators do looks with me this year has been the most fun ever. And oh my god, I love it. <laughs> yeah, and I'm super happy that I found you guys because you, you guys do the coolest looks together. Like, I wish I could get him to dress up in some of these things with me. Yeah, I don't dress up really. <laughs> <laughs> you guys do like the coolest pictures and stuff. And like, for our look, I don't know if I told you, but we ended up doing Dexter. So like, no. yeah, we were gonna do Beavis and Butthead, but then I realized like there's not too much makeup involved with that. <laughs> so we did Dexter and I was like, Dexter's victim and he was Dexter. I think the yeah. costume's been done quite a bit. She had me hold a knife <laughs> and I don't I didn't really feel comfortable with the knife. So I was just like <laughs> Yeah, he looks so awkward. <laughs> it's the weird. most awkward pictures. He's literally just like this with the knife. <laughs> but um it was really fun. But your the look that you guys did, sorry my dog keeps jumping up here. The look that you guys did is so cool and like the photos, you guys have a photographer that helps you? Um, well, it was supposed to be my brother, but then my sister hung out with someone who tested positive for COVID. So my brother was like, he's like, I can't anymore. So we did have a photographer do some of them, but the one of us walking that I sent you, my dad took that. And it's like my favorite picture nice. ever. And I'm like, this, it's like perfect. So has his confidence did. now after he uh, took that yeah. photo. <laughs> well, he was like. He kept asking, like, he's like, hey, like, if you want me to help you, like, I will. And I was like, no, I think we got it. Because, like, he doesn't <laughs> do that kind of stuff normally. And I just, I didn't want to make him feel, like, overwhelmed. Because it's, like, a massive camera. Yeah. And I've handed it over to someone. They're just like, what do I do with this? But it turned out really good. And, yeah, your yeah, photos are so cool. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I'm Joanna. Hi, I'm Chris. We're from Wisconsin. And we did a Pretty Woman couples costume. That sounds exactly... I always ruin this. I'm so sorry. <laughs> no, you're fine. This is like um, me trying to film any YouTube video ever. We... I think I messed up like six times. We probably took that video like... You're like, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah I like to do one take and just leave. If I messed up, then that's just what it is. What is? Wait, what do you mean we can't take a hundred pictures until we get the one? <laughs> Do you guys do anything cool for work or anything? Uh, I'm a realtor, so... That's cool. Anytime, like, a cool one comes on the market, like... We just go through the houses. Yeah. Just, oh, let's go sneak through that one, you know? Yeah. Like, oh, cool. Yeah, so... That sounds like so much fun. I just got done watching that show on Netflix, uh, Selling Sunset. Have you guys seen it? Oh, no. I no, but I keep hearing about someone's divorce yeah are you guys doing like a ton of halloween looks this year uh yeah <laughs> i have like five that i want to do um we just bought paneling for a lady gaga one. Oh, cool which tomorrow. what kind of lady gaga look because i i did the um skeleton one of hers oh cool i want to do the just dance one where she has like the disco ball bra and like the kind of like the 70s look going on like in the background so yeah so cool that, i'm actually gonna try to do your carry one really because i loved that one so much last year and i was just like that's like so cool so i want to do that it's a big I mess to yeah they say that's a big mess <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I saw I saw the video where you like did it in the tub or whatever. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna remember that. He was so mad too. That's why I stopped filming that clip because he's like, you're making a mess. <laughs> <laughs> Every Halloween though, she trashes the, the house <laughs> and the outside of the house too. I just make a mess <laughs> just everywhere. Trash everywhere. <laughs> well, I'm excited to see your looks. Are you doing like looks on your own or are they all couple looks? We have one more. We're gonna try to do Frankenstein's monster and bride oh, together. Oh, cool! I bought a forehead, so <laughs> I asked him before I bought. It, I was like, "Are you okay with me sticking this to your face?" Because <laughs> he has his limits. I tried to convince him to do Rocky Horror to be like Doctor Frankenfurter with me, and he's like, "I can't wear fish." It's like I'm sorry, but like <laughs> the internet is forever. And so, have you guys always lived in Wisconsin? Yeah. I grew up like 20 minutes away from him and 
I don't know, we all we just kind of had, like, the same circle of friends. Because you guys have been together for a long time, right? Yeah, uh, 12 years. It was 12 years this wow. August. Wow, that's crazy. That's a long time. Are you near the Wisconsin Dells? Uh, like an hour, uh, an hour and a half. What's that? Yeah, it's like yeah. north of It's us. like a, I've been there, yes. It's like a big water, <laughs> they have water parks everywhere. Oh, really? That's what I remember. Yeah, it's intense. It's like its whole, like, own culture up there. Yeah. I've never been to Wisconsin, but Jace used to tour in a band, so he's been, like, probably everywhere. Yeah, and then my friend on the farm in Wisconsin in, uh... Really? Yeah, I'm trying to remember <laughs> the name right. of the town. The town is so small. But I remember it was right next to the place that had squeaky cheese. <laughs> Curves, oh, yes. and it's hard to even explain what squeaky cheese is to anybody who hasn't had it before. Right. Yeah. How, like could, how could cheese be squeaky it. and why is that good? <laughs> but I do remember that. Well, from where we're at, we're like uh, about a half hour from Madison, maybe 45 minutes from Milwaukee, and then uh, an hour and a half from Chicago. Oh, wow. So we could go, you know, wherever. But, you know, I don't know. So it's a good location. I yeah. Like. That's nice. Like, Are you trying to sell us right now? <laughs> <laughs> it's all about location, right? I've been watching too many realtor shows lately. What about <laughs> what about you? Did you say what you do for work? No. So I went to school. I majored in communications, emphasis in public relations. So, like, social media, marketing, um... So I just work with different businesses to kind of create their social media presence and then maintain it, organize events, press releases, stuff like that. So it's exciting. It's different every time, which is nice because I feel like I get bored when it's like the same thing over and over and over again. Yeah. So you always have something new to work on. Yeah. And it's like usually everyone's looking for something different. So it's like, you know, one person might want or business might want like to start their social media presence and then someone else would be like, well, we have this event we really want to promote and we need to like create like flyers and whatever for it. So I get to do a little bit of creative work. So that's nice, but then also use my degree, which I appreciate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, you guys are, are you're big fans of Halloween, obviously, right? Oh my God. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Wait, I think she is more than that I am. You just, you're kind of just like along for the ride, which yeah. I appreciate. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of same with him too yeah like i don't see how anyone could dislike halloween but i don't go as wild as you do yeah like he's not, not dressing up or anything i'm not doing 15 looks this year <laughs> <laughs> one I like, is I like candy like i'll have some candy yeah watch the i'll watch the movie yeah you know? <laughs> yeah i'll watch the movie yeah i always watch the yeah. movie and what kind of candy do you guys like like what's your favorite candy to get for halloween uh i don't think that there is one candy for me i think that whatever it is i will binge and eat all of it <laughs> that is not a lie i'll eat chocolate and sour candy and everything so i'm just what's the word well i'm reckless <laughs> <laughs> so you know i'll eat everything I respect yeah, that. And you do. Yeah. yeah. That's how it goes. So. <laughs> like, the candy dishes that are out there, there's no candy in them already. <laughs> and we filled them, like... Two days ago. Probably three times now, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? What's your favorite candy? I think... I think Twix. Mm. Twix yeah, is a popular some... one. Twix or I when I was younger um I always liked getting those Twizzlers like I feel like Halloween you know like the ones that are like softer mm -hmm. they're softer like, at Halloween they're, like, they're individually wrapped yeah, yeah. and they just like, do a better job you can't they, find you know, them yeah well I, I think the idea is like like okay kid tastes the candy and they go they get hooked on it they're like this was they know the candy what is it the candy company did no, they're putting out the good stuff that's individually wrapped, so they're hooked for life. They're like, I got that at Halloween, and now I need to have this for the rest I of my life. all the time. Yeah. But I liked those ones a lot when I was younger. We live on a busier road, so we don't hand out candy. But... Well, we did one year, and like three kids tried walking into our house, and I was like, I'm done. 
like <laughs> this is so weird. Yeah, no thank you. We're like you. on the porch and they just like wander. Just kind of wander around and try to open the door. Like, oh no, that's no, that's not yeah. what this is. Usually you don't <laughs> open the door. Like, <laughs> sneezed right in the bowl of candy and I'm just like, you're gross. Like, yeah. stop. <laughs> I'm thinking just about put it out there, like just yeah. free for all. I guess. <laughs> Yeah. There was some. There was a guy in Wisconsin who was like on the news for. Um, he like built a tube to like give candy with being and still staying six feet. Yeah, away. I was about to say. I've been thinking about building one of those shoots. <laughs> but uh, I think that'd be fun, no matter what. You just wait in there, and the candy shoots. This up is the bottom. first I'm hearing of the shoot, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I've been thinking about it because. I don't want to go outside a million times. Yeah, and last year we did a bowl. Like, we decorated um, a bowl on a table on our porch area so that kids could just come take candy because our dogs go crazy if anybody barks. Or if anybody, <laughs> if anybody knocks. And, um... Just come by and bark all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, um, we have the ring doorbell so we can see when anyone's at our door anyways. And we heard, like, a bunch of ruckus going on outside, so we, like, opened the app on our phone. And we saw, like, these three kids, and one of them was just, like, taking everything into his bag. And, like, Jace ended up opening the door and saying, like, what did well, you do? First of all, the kid wasn't even wearing a costume. He just, like, had a t-shirt that said Fortnite. I was like, that's not a costume. <laughs> and then he dumped, yeah, he dumped a whole bowl in his candy, and I go out, and I'm like, and he, the kid who took the candy had gone off, but his, like, uh, his brother was there, and he's like, oh, no, my brother... <laughs> My brother took it all. So I had to, I, I like chased him down the road. I'm like, did you take all the candy? He's like, yeah. <laughs> and he came back and he just starts taking candy out of his bag. Like it whatever even candy, our not candy. even ours, just whatever candy. He goes, tell me when to stop. <laughs> yeah. I'm obsessed with how you edit those videos. It's so cool. Oh, like, thank you. Like it, they're, they're fun to watch. It's like not like what other people do. It's just like, I like the colors and all the little extra things. So thank you. I'm excited to be ours. <laughs> oh, well, thank you guys so much for, like, putting this look together to be in my video. It's so, it's been so much fun to see what everyone comes up with, and I was so excited to have a couples thing because, like, we wanted to do a couples look this year, but I didn't even think about having another couple do, like, a look until I saw that you had, like, responded to my thing on Instagram. And when I looked at your profile, I was just like immediately obsessed with both of you and the looks that you guys do. So I'm super happy that we all got to chat. If we ever find ourselves in Wisconsin, we'll have to get together and maybe try squeaky cheese, even though I don't eat dairy. I might try it. <laughs> <laughs> it's worth it. I think if you can find coronavirus ever goes away and we're allowed to travel again we're always like we always go to new york so if we ever drive through that way we should totally hang out or something or if you guys ever come out here he's been dying to go back we've been to la a few times and he has family in san francisco so he like loves it out there yeah you guys should totally come if you do let us know we'll have to do something together yeah for sure that would be fun <laughs> All right, well, thank you guys so much. I hope you have a good night, right? It's nighttime over there by now. So. Yeah. <laughs> have a good night. Don't forget to text me that movie so I don't forget. Yes. And I, I'll send you that link. Kiss of something or the last, I'll find it and I'll send it to you. <laughs> okay, well, have a good night, guys. <laughs> All right. You too. Bye. Bye. Bye.